Hey everybody, it's Pamela and I am back and I'm going to be doing another handbag review video for you today. I realized actually that I haven't done one of these in a while and you know I love my handbags. I love raiding my closet for you. So we're going to review this Melly Bianco super cute polka dot clutch. So let's get started. Okay, I'm going to get into the clutch in a minute, but before I do, I just wanted to say congratulations to Giselle Bruno. She is the winner of the 50 subscriber giveaway that I did last week. I think it was actually like two weeks ago. I'm going to link to the video giveaway below and it's closed now. The giveaway is over, but at least you can see the kinds of things that I do for giveaways when I do them. I did a 50 subscriber giveaway where I gave away a $25 coupon to Petit Boar. It's a, um, they're online purveyors of all things cruelty free in terms of skincare and makeup. It's all vegan, all cruelty free. So those are the kinds of things that I'm gonna be doing for giveaways. And I actually surpassed the 50 subscriber mark pretty quickly, much more quickly than I anticipated. So first of all, thank you guys so much for tuning into this channel. It really means a lot to me that you're here, that you're following me, that you're interested in what I have to say and um, what I have to show you, which we'll get to in a minute. Um, but yeah, again, I just wanted to congratulate yourself and hopefully you are doing some great shopping on Petit Bois right now. So let's get into the handbag. This is actually a, a crossbody from, it's a clutch and it's also a crossbody from Melly Bianco. I'm gonna put the link in the description below. Melly Bianco makes all vegan, really, really cute handbags. They are often found in like boutique shops. I don't know if the bigger department stores really carry them or not. Mostly I've seen this brand in smaller boutique shops and that's where I like to shop anyway. I will go into bigger department stores, but I just find them overwhelming. And I really like to shop in smaller boutiques and support smaller businesses when I have the chance. I got this actual bag online. I ordered it online. And I know Melly Bianco doesn't offer this specific bag anymore, but I'm gonna link you to a very similar bag that I found. It's a patent version kind of of this. So it's synthetic patent leather. I'll link you to it in the description below. But I wanted to show you this because, um, like I said, I love raiding my closet for you guys. <laughs> but also, this is a really cute, great little purse for summertime coming up, and I love the polka dot pattern. It never goes out of style. It's a fun style. It's great for summer. This is just a really super fun bag for the upcoming warm weather. I love the like the gold kind of detailing here. Yeah, I guess it's a gold color with the black handle and actually it opens this way. So let me turn it around and show it to you this way. So the handle just, you can press it closed like that and then to open it up, you push the handle backwards and it just opens really easily. Um, yeah, the gold detailing and gold chain, I've featured other videos where I have um, bags with chains on them instead of the strap. And I really like that. I just think it gives a classier look I think the gold is a great contrast against something like this where it's black and white and gold. In fact, I think the other bag that I did was also black and white and <laughs> had a gold chain. So there's kind of a theme going here. It's really, really soft. This is a faux leather. And I think I mentioned that Melly Bianco does only vegan leather handbags. If I did not mention that, then let me say that now. I'm definitely gonna link you up to their website so you can see what they have now. And it's soft. Like some vegan handbags that I've bought in the past I love the way they look, but the leather, the leather is, um, the, I should say the material is a little bit stiffer and I really don't mind that if it doesn't impede the function of the bag, but I just like this because it's really, really soft and it's like kind of a pouch and it just feels good. Let me show you the inside. So inside just really basic, it's black lining. Now I will say I tend to like a lighter colored lining better because it's easier to see what's in your bag. This isn't such a big bag that it really matters for the size of this clutch. It doesn't really matter that much what color the lining is, but you know, if I were to take this out to dinner or an evening function where it's darker where I am, it's just, you know, a little bit harder to see what's in your bag, that's all. I generally like lighter colored lining, but in a bag this size, it's not gonna make too much of a difference. Open up the pocket for you. And it's just, you know, your basic credit card, money pocket, keep your lipstick in there so it doesn't get lost. There's enough room in here for a phone, a wallet, some makeup. There's definitely, it's definitely pretty roomy. Like, here's my phone, it's 
the 6S, I guess. So you can see it fits very easily in here and there's room for much more. All in all, I think this is a great, really super cute clutch that you can pair with a lot of things. And like I said, I will link you up to a similar bag online that you can find. It's gonna be a patent version of this. If I can find a, a version that's not patent, I'm sure I can. I will also link you to that. I just wanna make sure that it's vegan and not real leather. So the patent one I found online, um, it's not by Melly Bianco, but it's very similar style and it is patent. And I chose it because I think it's also very cute, but it's also vegan. So there you have it. I love this purse. I love the Melly Bianco line. Um, you can find them, like I said, in small boutiques. You can go to mellybianco.com. They are not paying me for this review. I get absolutely nothing from them for these reviews. I would love it if they would send me some purses, <laughs> but, but they haven't. So this is all my stuff that I'm showing you. And I go into my closet whenever I do these videos, bring out my favorite things and show you what I've got to show you the, the real variety of items that you can buy, vegan friendly items, faux leather, animal friendly, that you can find on the market. This specific bag that I show you may not still be made by that company, but I just wanna show you what's possible and what's out there. And you can definitely find, like I said, you can find similar to this bag, you can find similar to other bags that I've shown you in the past. So that's it for this bag. It's gonna be a short video, a short review, but I wanted to just quickly pop on and congratulate again Giselle, and to show you that you can be stylish and beautiful while choosing products that don't harm animals. So I hope you've enjoyed this review and I will see you next time. Bye.